other people did a complaint to alkaline and now that him sell 25 copies them don't really have much for stand up on one song one song can stand up on that come like a chair with one foot it must drop maybe the only excuse we can give is that it was for ladies only so maybe at ladies only they are listening to it and <laughs> the view is cutting a half maybe i don't know judge a god them say skill cell 25 unit but i thought about it still so far I'm not gonna lie, many things Skilly Bank should have put a price for the album. Yeah. I think him should have just make it be free and done. Because no marketing never the behind it. No promotion never the behind it. Honestly, I just see the song that I drop on YouTube and I wonder how so much song I drop. I never know say it was a slappy tape. The only way I know say it was a. Not even slappy tape, sorry. We named the Prodigy Ladies Only. The only way me know say it was actually like a mixtape was when me say the whole of the song that me drop have the same cover art on it. So me realize say okay, it look like it's a mixtape. But me not think him they take it that seriously as oh me I try to compete with other man in other genre in terms of sales and this and that. So me not even go compared to what alkaline do or nobody else for be honest with you me just feel like say him just did a drop a mixtape when do it somebody and i don't know for what reason but him decide to put a price on it and sell it whether that is detrimental or not we're gonna talk about that but yeah for be honest with you what i am going to criticize was the fact say that mixtape there i already talked about the marketing behind it because all of the songs them not even did drop in a one day i think some of them did drop one next day and like i think i like three days straight in like he might drop the song them one by one and i say what is and then now the thing with the the album i'm not gonna lie to you it wasn't that good it wasn't that good me never hear no song where really stand out to me all of them did kind of sound similar it did seem like it was just a rush thing may I be completely honest with you I'm gonna pick up for the man in terms of that it never seemed like quality cuz me I gonna be honest with you I listen to previous skilly bang mixtape before him even boss and the man could have put together him thing him have a varying him did have a varying style in terms of him sang them too some of them lyrical some of them this but that that the mixtape was just basically me that say all of the song them was just some one syllable for the chorus and then a regular ass verse like none of them never really stand out to me only thing in the creator challenge with the sloppy challenge and the girl them did i get wild and everything and that song that they kind of pop up because people are listening to it but honestly the mixtape it never seemed like it was prepared for be something where it was going to be sold should we condemn him for selling 25 copies because based on what i must say within the first week him sell 25 pure copies and 300 units overall even if it was rushed and even if it wasn't well marketed and them something there, i feel like skilly bank should have pulled more than 300 units honestly 300 units and 25 pure sales i feel like skilly bank should have pulled in more than that 
but it just goes back to the quality the quality of the old mixtape was not that good in my opinion i can't even lie to you and tell you say it was it wasn't one of the things that mommy hear people are say is because it did drop on youtube um it that would have hurt the sales and because it did up on audio mac and them something people need to understand say them things that count towards the streams so that would have in at the 300 units so we can't really use that as an excuse now maybe the only excuse we can give is that it was for ladies only so maybe at ladies only they are listening to it and <laughs> the views cutting her off maybe i don't know that are the only excuse we can give in terms of this sale because anything else me have to just put the accountability by him in terms of poor marketing yeah poor marketing and low quality it wasn't that good the fact said nobody never know about it until it dropped and we just listen to it and then we hear song back a song back a song and we say oh this look like a mixtape that means it in the market good that means it you never prepare your audience for no say yo you see like how everybody did no say top prize did come out and like how everybody did no say like how everybody now no say um 438 i gonna come out for massacre that is how you market the album people actually know say it's gonna drop and people actually prepare themselves and prepare them pocket remember say this a covid time like point per short space notice people not gonna really get up and spend money like that but that are my opinion um I'm sure skilly bang not really troubled by the 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 outcome of the um sales i feel like it never really mattered to him i feel like he never really take it that seriously anyway i feel like more people the i feel like the people them who actually are review it and the blogger them care more about the outcome of the sales than skilly bang because at the same time none of them were did that discredit alkaline and did have skilly bang as the artist where they must say is the top artist which in my opinion skilly bang is the hottest artist he has the hottest song skilly bang haven't proved himself yet to be honest with you but other people did a compare him to alkaline and now that himself 25 copies them not really have much for stand up on one song one song can stand up on that come like a chair with one foot it must drop you understand so I feel like say it hurt them argument and them did care more about the sales than skilly bang obviously so that is all i have to say about it um may i look out for more music from him actually I want him for do more quality control release less music and focus more upon um putting out more potent music music where I go hit harder and not just be something for listen to and then be forgettable that is my advice from a binner push but that is my opinion if you're new to the channel make sure you say like share subscribe turn on post notification i'm out